Hey, how are you guys doing? It's me, Brandon Smith, or Gay Reaper, and which number was this one? Three or four. This one was the No, your mom's was the third one. This one has to be the fourth. Yeah, that's the fourth. So yeah, this one was the fourth one made. The one he has in his room is the first. Brush. This one's the fourth. The Halloween one, which he is working on right now, he's updating it to make it look a lot cooler. Um... So yeah, this one has butterflies, as you guys can see from H1, H1 varies, one of them was a lamp, which is pretty cool. So this one actually has a little guy with a mushroom for an umbrella, he has these flowers, this one is it's pretty cool. I really like the log that he used for it as well. Something he actually wants to think of doing, for one, is it'll open up, but he cannot really do that until he... Uh, confirms that that he that's something he wants to do, but that would be really cool. It's like it's like a little house that you can like fully, like design stuff like that, you know. But uh, this one's just a normal looking one. This one actually has a dragonfly. I didn't even notice that. That was like, it looks a lot cooler. I didn't notice the dragonfly. All right, so professional recording. Um, then let me show you the back, so I can actually show you the back on this one. And there's all those little flowers down there. Got uh, he does really good on the trees because it makes it to where you can actually really tell that it's like growing out of it and stuff like that. But uh, he does a really good job. Sneak peek of the Halloween one. Now back to this one. It is? Yeah. Oh, can I cut it in then? Yeah. Okay. So then he edited this one. This one actually, if you noticed, uh, we took it back from my family member's house. If you watched the previous video. Oh, I gotta get down. Okay. So then he's implemented some more stuff, like that little plant right there, some rocks. He implemented a little wood right there. The cauldron is boiling over. These are a lot oh these are a lot shorter. Then you've got a spider on it. That spider's actually scented for me. It does not smell very good, but it's supposed to smell like cherry. It could just be a very strong scent of cherry. But uh how do I turn these on? I will place the phone down for a second, just so I can turn on the lights. Um, you will see blackness for a few seconds. Uh, burf. And, uh, uh, okay, I can't find the switch on this one. Uh, 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 burf. There we go. Okay, now back to the light. Still in. Sorry for that darkness. But yeah, it's really cool. Uh, this would actually be really cool as a Halloween decoration outside. Um, there's little tombstones down there, I say Rip, Rip Larry, <laughs> and then, uh, as you guys noticed, this one is, also has these growing up it now, I don't know how many of you actually decided to pause the video for a quick second, and as you know, this one is the only one with two steps, there's little stuff on it, is there anything new on the back, oh, right, hold on, let me show you. So yeah, this, it's only one with two staircases. Yeah, so he actually implanted some windows now, which oh, that's a chance. Uh boop. There we go. Okay. Sorry for like the really crappy recording. Um I'm recording this on a phone. <laughs> then this little witch, he actually the reason why it has a skull is he actually hand carved that to fit it, which I found really cool that it has a skull mask. So it's the Halloween. Kind of thing, and then, uh, yeah, and then he has little stones all wrapping around that. There's like, what is that inside the cauldron, by the way? There's green goo. Green goo. <laughs> Just green goo. Uh, let me show you the back. The back house. There's, this is his whole setup right here. He uses glue sticks and all that. It's really cool. Then there's another window right there, and then you know. And it has a little bird on top with a little nest. There's another one with a nest on it. One of the ones that I showed you sneak peek, there was a bird that was supposed to be on it that apparently fell off. I didn't even notice that. But, uh, yeah, it's really cool. It makes it look all dead, graveyardy, Halloween like. And I'll give you a sneak peek of this one real quickly. Let me move this door. Where are the birds supposed to go? In the top. In the top part. Okay, hold on. Uh, birth, the bird way up there, yes, and then put you there.
But these are not the real placements of the birds. Okay, just, okay, I can't do anything with this. There's four, here, I'll just show you everything that's gonna go on it real quickly. Move that, so. Just say this, you get this one. Yeah. Because that one still has a lot of designing to do. There we go. So, yeah, that's everything that's gonna be on it. So, um, get a shot of my, if I remember. Uh, so, I don't know what I'm doing. So, do you, what is your next idea going to be? Um, I have no idea. I just play them by ear and pick some, make them one at a time. Usually because people w want one and they want it designed a totally different, and that's usually when I start designing them. Mm -hmm. So when people want other things, mm -hmm. and I just do different things to every single one of them, so that none of them are the exact same. Mm. They're all gonna be unique. Yep, they're Cause... all unique. They're all, uh, they're all hand carved. They're all hand worked. Um, they're pretty sturdy for what they are. So. I mean, it does take me a little while to make them, so if you want one, you can contact me on the on uh, Facebook, on my Facebook page, and then I can talk to you and then talk to you more about prices and mm. what you what you'd like to see if you want are interested in buying one. Okay. And then he's going to do a little beta thing with like a something he wanted to try because I said so that I wanted this it is a dragon cave. He probably might not make it for you because it's the. He's never done a dragon cape at all, and he probably will not do a dragon cape other than for me, because I am his child and I am a precious boy. <laughs> not really, but uh, yeah, this one's running on way too long. But um, you know, let's get back a sneak peek at this one. So these are the ones that he's made and finished. This one you got a sneak peek of, and this one's the complete product with the little lights. So what he did. All in all. Uh, my opinion out of all of them, the first one is my favorite. This one's my second favorite, by far. Uh, the one that's a lamp has probably been my third favorite. But uh, it's really cool that he made this on a Black Widow as well. It's really cool. Suits it. But uh, as always, if anyone's going to end, and I'll see you, Assassins, in the next video. Goodbye. <laughs>